Alright guys, here's my first tutorial, how to draw an anime eye. Now excuse the camera quality. Alright, let's get started. Um, well, first of all, uh, I just like to draw the frame first, so um, I like the upper eyelash. Just flipping it around here. You know, like you put that like little dent in the middle there. Sometimes it goes all the way down. It depends on like what character you're drawing or however you like it. But um, that's how I start usually. Um, right now, what I'm doing is I'm just rounding the corner off right there. You saw me do like a couple seconds ago. All right, um, bottom eyelash thing. I don't know if you call it an eyelash. I guess that's what they are since it's an eye, I guess. <laughs> um, I'm just going to put this part right here um, at the end. It just kind of closes it up so it doesn't look like the eye is pointing upward. So that's just why I'm putting it in there. Now I'm just going to shade it real fast. And again, excuse the camera quality. Um, my uh, tripod isn't so good and um, if I zoomed in anymore, um, it would be even blurrier, so just excuse that. Um, now I'm just drawing the uh, act, like the important part of the eye here, like the iris and pupil. Um, I'm shading the outside here, just like the very, like the very tip, like I'm just pretty much just pressing a little harder on the line, I'm not actually adding another line. Um, just darkening it, I'm just darkening that line right there. You almost just have to press harder on the pencil. That's it. You don't add any other lines or else it could look really thick and you don't want that. Um, Alright, right now what I'm doing is I'm adding the like the uh, shine, like when the like light reflects off of the eye. Um, those parts are not going to be shaded. So um, right now I'm just adding outer shading um, to correspond with the light. And what I'm doing right now, I'm rubbing my finger right on the eye here because it's a little trick I picked up. It looks more, like the shading looks more smooth and prominent when um, you just smudge your finger on there. It doesn't really work with colored pencils. That's why most of my drawings are black and white because I want to be able to show you guys this little, um, uh, this little trick. Right now I'm just erasing the excess that came out of the iris, out of the circle there. Um, all right, what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna, you know, just go over the eyelash parts. Is um, that's just, I don't know. I just like to double up on those, make them look more prominent, you know, stand out more. Um, and now I'm just gonna go up the upper eye, like the uh, eyelid right here. You're, you're probably gonna be seeing the um, uh, overlapping almost every line I make except if I'm happy with it. <laughs> um, Alright, so you basically got sort of um, what the eye is. Again, excuse, excuse the blurriness, please. Um, I'm just fooling around with the zoom right here, and I just never got a chance to um, crop out this part of the video. But there, uh, there it is so far. You got, um, I'm going to be adding an eyebrow. The eyebrow. I think that's what I'm doing now. Yep. It is. Um, again, it, it depends on who, uh, who's Tara, like what character you're drawing, because um, you know all different kind of cartoons, like Bleach, Naruto, all those different cartoons. They have like you know, well, all of them have different like facial features, and um, just depends on who you're drawing. That's how you're gonna draw the eye and everything. It all revolves around who that who you're drawing. Um, Again, uh, just a little tip here. You just might want to um, draw like the skin folds. That's like what I'm doing right now. Like uh, if you scrunch up your face, obviously you're gonna see some wrinkles. You know, if you're looking in a mirror. So that's what I'm doing right now. Like um, just putting in like the smallest little details. Um, that's not part of the eyebrow. That's like the skin around it. That's kind of bending. It's not like an arrow shape. Um, Right here, I'm just like shading out like the um, sh like the shadows that the nose the uh, bleh, the nose bridge would make. 
Um, now that part is sort of, you might want to call it optional. You don't really have to do that, but um, like I kind of went on a little drastic angle on that. So um, it again, it all depends on who you're drawing. Um, just a little some more like wrinkles. Just finishing up here. Now I'm actually drawing like just like the faint thing of a uh, nose bridge right there. Again, it's a really sharp angle, so you might not want to do that. So um, when it's done, it should look like this. Um, but again, it all depends on who you're drawing. So um, again, thanks for watching and um, put in your requests, uh, comment, rate, and subscribe for more. All right, see you later, guys.